Wait, what's under this rock? Oh my gosh, it's brittle stars. A lot of brittle stars. Most of them were these common banded brittle stars, but I did find this one Panama brittle star, which is a super special find for me. I don't find them often. I just love watching them move around and do little flips. <laughs> They're so agile and it's really fun to watch their five little arms. And keep in mind they are brittle, so you don't have to lift rocks to find them. You just have to look really closely. See, they're there. Sometimes their limbs do break off, and so here's me explaining it to some little girls I met. You see how this leg right here is a little bit shorter? Yeah. You know why? He made it fall off and then is growing it back. Exactly, they can regenerate their legs. So brittle stars aren't actually sea stars or what people call starfish, they're just closely related. But what's really cool about both of them is that if they lose a limb and it's still connected to the central portion of the body, it can create an entirely new starfish. I totally geek out over this, like imagine if we had our arm chopped off and then we could build an entire new body from that. That's wild. 